The University of Rhode Island continues its efforts to go green, this time by using used French fry oil to power one of its research vessels around the world. The research vessel, the Endeavor, recently topped off its fuel tank with 16,000 gallons of refined biofuel, making it the first ship in the U.S. research fleet to use alternative fuel. It occurred to us that we ought to be running the most environmentally friendly campus and scientific facilities uh, that we could possibly could. To do that, the Endeavor will now run on biodiesel, a product made from used vegetable oil, and formulated here at Newport Biodiesel in Newport. From here, it is mixed with regular diesel and sold by local diesel distributors. We checked it with the engines manufacturers for both the main engines and the auxiliaries and they agreed with us that the blending would actually be better for the engines than simply using regular diesel. For now the fuel is made of 5 percent biodiesel but they hope to increase the mix to 20 percent. More than 20 percent biodiesel would require some engine modifications. <laughs> Continuing the efforts to green the endeavor, more efficient lighting, appliances, and water heaters will be put on board, which could allow one of three generators on board to be turned off. We could be burning hundreds of fuel, hundreds of gallons of fuel less per day if we reduce our energy demand on board the ships. The ship will run quieter and less harmful emissions will be emitted, all because of used French fry oil. Anything we can do to reduce our dependence on fossil fuels is a good thing. And originally URI was concerned it would cost more money to use the biodiesel. As it turns out, it was a couple pennies cheaper, which adds up to quite a bit when you're sailing around the world. For the Green Team, I'm TJ Del Santo. I would